everybody, how are we? My name is Zeno Pandu. Welcome back to another video. So, Amber uploaded not too long ago. I'm shocked. I usually don't catch her <laughs> her videos when they go up. But she uploaded, let's go shopping. My mom cooked dinner for me with recipe, which I guess we'll see if um, Amber got her cooking skills from her mother because there's been a lot of choices throughout the years and I'm very curious. <laughs> And mother-daughter grandma day. Oh my, we're doing so much. Jesus Christ. It's just like thing after thing after thing. So let's see what Amber has to say today because we have a video to get through today. Hello, hello. Good morning. So I'm trying to crimp my hair again because I... And I will say that I do like her hair crimped. It, it's very um sassy and it looks good on her. Realized, really enjoy it. But something I've also realized, this side of my hair does not accept the crimp as good as this side. This isn't the first time this has happened. This seems to happen every single time I crimp my hair and it's annoying and frustrating, but I still think she looks cute. So we're just gonna accept it. Now, did you put heat protectant on your hair and um, go, I think it just needs to, a trim. Like I get having long hair and then like, you know, wanting to keep it long, but like you gotta trim it at some point because it looks kind of raggedy to keep it honest it's just it doesn't look super great girl i'm sorry just just get rid of a few inches that to make it look a little bit better your hair will thank you i promise what do you guys think i i don't know i've been loving the crimping if you guys remember last vlog uh last night i got a little drunk <laughs> it was it was a moment in time okay i just wanted to let loose a little bit and so i did it's not oh my gosh amber you were so crazy for doing it inside of your closet of all things wild girl calm down you are doing too much <laughs> it's definitely not going to be something that i do often but anyways i am actually hanging out with my mom today we're gonna go to a few stores um she wants to get a wallet for her new purse and she invited me to go with her and then she wants to make me this like recipe from her pioneer woman recipe book that she really likes so she's gonna be making me dinner tonight and okay, I'm really okay so we're not getting a original recipe which makes me sad honestly like if i wanted to go get like a pioneer woman i mean i could just go get the book myself but i guess this is a uh i guess look in to see if, if you want the pioneer woman recipe book and I guess here you go, but I wanted something a little bit more homemade and sassy. Come on. I'm excited. So I'm going to try to vlog as much as I can. I think I need to touch up my nails. So I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to put on some rings. I already have my hoops on. My choker, you can't even really see it. With choker hoops. Gotta get her nails done. She is ready to go, girls. Come on. <laughs> So, I'm so used to Chantal's, like, nothing. This this just seems like a lot, and I'm here for it, to be honest with you. <laughs> it's just like, oh, we're doing things, we're going places, we're saying things. There's so much happening. With this outfit, but I am pretty much ready for the day. Okay, so we're at the outlet mall right now, and it's been so windy the last few days. But I actually just left my aunt's house. Can you guys even hear me? I don't know. No. This should probably have been a voiceover, but no, girl, we, we really can't. <laughs> Hold on. I just saw cousins that I haven't seen since they were babies, so it was a whole moment. It was pretty freaking great. But I think we're gonna go into Torrid. Me and my mom. My mom's never been to Torrid before, so it's gonna be an experience. So let's go. So my mom saw this and she went, oh, you can bring Twinkie to Torrid? <laughs> Say hi, mom. Oh, wait. Oh, you can make a heart. <laughs> Oh, wait, that's wait. cute. <laughs> now, judging by Amber's past and the things that the mom's done, I mean, I am a little bit kind of worried for her in a way, but, like, at the end of the day, they, they, they're cute. I'm happy that she's closer to family, but, like, again, it's kind of kind of like a... Uh, just be careful, girl. <laughs> There's been issues in the past, and I just I'm, it worries me that something might happen in the future. I'm hoping not. Hoping not, but you have to keep that in mind that something might happen, but I'm hoping for the best here, naturally. All right. Oh, girl, I see my store. Uh, you guys can go in there. I can go. Oh, you guys can't see my cursor, but I'm going to Bath and Body Works. I need some more gingham. It, it'd be fine. We, we can meet up um, after because I'm going to be a while. That and also, like, this mall is so fancy. I'm sitting here looking like, oh, my gosh, wow. Like, there's places to sit. There's vending machines. And here locally, we're lucky to even have like a restaurant. <laughs> there is Torin. You guys, after a long day, my hair stayed curled on this side. 
And then this side, like I said, <laughs> just it, it wants to stay straight. I don't know what it is, but look how. Wow, it's like you have straight hair or something. Wow. <laughs> Pretty. All right, we're gonna do a taste test. Um, I saw these at the good old TJ Maxx. I saw them. My mom saw them, yes. <laughs> they're sesame chips. Uh, well, safe to say that they're definitely related. <laughs> now I saw them. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Sweet and spicy honey roasted pineapple habanero. Are you gonna try one? Yeah? Sure. Okay, I'll take a bite. Ew, they smell no good. <laughs> they smell like dirt. <laughs> I wish you guys could see your face. One day you might. They look like this. We've seen her face before though. <laughs> Girl. All right. Definitely not with the picture face. Wait, they're so good. Okay, so what you guys are about to experience is something I would normally edit out, but my mom's like, no, keep that in there. That is us breaking out in laughter for who knows why. <laughs> Wait, they're so good. Do you like it? <laughs> Do you like it, mom? She's going in for a second one to get the full effect. What do you think? Odd. You think it's odd? Mm -hmm. They're sweet. You literally taste the pineapple sweetness. Like when you swallow, you get the little habanero. Wow. Oh my gosh, it's like the pineapple habanero or something. Wow. I would have never guessed, guys. <laughs> 10 out of 10 recommend. <laughs> She's laughing at me. She doesn't understand the YouTube. <laughs> She doesn't get it. Why was that funny, Mom? Recommend. <laughs> uh, here we have Twinkie. Twink. Oh my God, Twinkie door. Oh my God, love her. Yeah, you can't have none of that. Hey guys, it is the next day. So today, me and my mom, we're gonna go pick up my grandma because my grandma wants to go shopping, and then we're gonna go out to lunch. So that is the plan. And also, my grandma's gonna come over and see my apartment. So that's also exciting. Oh, I didn't show you guys yesterday when we went to. <laughs> TJ Maxx. We hold this like this, Mom. I have uh, this mattress right here. Whoa, hi. <laughs> this mattress, ignore it, it'll be gone soon. But I needed a little trash can for my uh, bathroom, so I got that from TJ Maxx. And then this is a toilet brush and plunger caddy. I also needed one of them because I didn't have either of these things. Got them. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's me after I don't have any caffeine during the day. I at least want credits beer Halloween, come on. My grandma is still inside, she's checking out now, but I didn't have like a normal comforter, so I got this uh, plaid white and gray comforter, king size, and it's so thick and soft. Is that white and gray or is that like gray and gray? Like eggshell and gray maybe? Uh, it's not white, I don't think, but like it could be the lighting, I don't know, but why? Eh, it doesn't look super white to me. Okay, so today has been super busy. We dropped off my grandma, but I got to go into her house, which is actually where I used to live a long, long time ago. And she just like showed me around because um, I love how she decorates her house. It's awesome. But yeah, she showed me photos of when she was like a lot younger and just a lot of family bonding time. And before that, we like went to some stores. We had lunch. We had lunch hours and hours ago. Um, and remember the meal I said my mom was going to make for us yesterday? Well, we forgot uh, the main ingredient, which is chicken. We forgot it. How, how do you forget chicken? Like, I can understand, like, forgetting a bell pepper, forgetting some olives, forgetting maybe an onion, like a tomato, but, like, how do you forget a chicken? <laughs> I think that's kind of kind of a prevalent thing that you, you're supposed to remember, the, like, probably the main, main ingredient. And so my mom's like, let's just make it tomorrow, so she's going to make the recipe when we get back to my place. It's like this teriyaki chicken situation with like there's broccoli and asparagus and stuff like that so i'm super excited to try it she said it's one of her favorite recipes so and it was so cute um the waiter at the uh restaurant we went to he ended up just like talking to us and turns out like he's gay and his family wasn't accepting and we like bonded over just like being gay and it was like this whole moment and like my mom and my grandma were like obsessed with him and i don't know he was just like an amazing waiter like we had such a good experience like he told us like his whole okay. life okay number one was he cute very, I know, very important question for me at least, but like, can he be a side character, please? Please. <laughs> we need some local girls. Like, come on. Story and, oh no, it was just super cute. Like, I love that I have such supportive family when it comes to like me being gay and stuff. I don't know. I just can't imagine like 
it being any other way. So the waiter really took a liking to my mom and to my grandma and to me, obviously, because we're both. And that's also really cute. I mean, if this story is true, because Amber, I, it's Amber, you have to kind of keep that to mind. But if that story is true, it's very cute. Okay. But I don't know, it was just super cute. He kept coming back and like telling us more of his story. And I don't know, it was just so fun. So this is the recipe book that my mom will be using that she likes to use. And she has some spots saved here. But the recipe she will be doing is on page 246. So let me find that for y'all. 246. So it's this, the teriyaki chicken sheet pan supper. So that's how it's gonna look when it's done. All right, so my mom has started. She is cutting off the asparagus that we don't use, I guess, apparently. Does she know nothing about food <laughs> that we don't use apparently? Yeah, girl. Oh, good lord. I thought I was bad when it comes to- <laughs> I thought I was bad when it comes to cooking. <laughs> nope, I know more than Amber. <laughs> she has this baking sheet ready to go. All the veggies we need. So, all right, you guys. So all the veggies are cut. Ooh, that is gorgeous, though. Especially with those bell peppers in there. Ooh, yum. And then next she's going to add chicken and teriyaki sauce right yeah first i have to put the teriyaki sauce on the uh, vegetables okay so i will say i kind of want to make this now it looks so good wow this looks healthy all right now she's putting on the sauce all right so it is finished and out of the oven she's now adding some sesame seeds on top here and then she adds a little bit of cilantro on top oh yeah nope i'm skipping that i'm one of those people that it, cilantro tastes like soap <laughs> I, I can't do it. And then that is the finished product. And we also have some cauliflower rice for the side. All right, so here is my plate. Here's my mom's plate. And now I'm gonna do a little taste test. All right, so I'm gonna try the broccoli and onion. That's good, mom. I'm worried about the asparagus because the only time I like asparagus is when it's raw and dipped in cottage cheese and mustard, if you guys remember. Uh -huh. What? I love asparagus too, but I would never eat it raw. Ugh. That's just a me thing though, but like, bees and let bees, but mm -mm. So here we go with the asparagus. Mm-hmm. I made her cook the chicken for longer than she normally would have because I'm so- That's why it looks so dry. I wasn't gonna, like, mention that. It looked kind of dry, but that, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Weird about it. You guys know me. All right, here's the chicken. I'm so good, Mom. You like it? Mm-hmm. Thank you for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my mom left a little bit ago. Okay, I was wrong. That actually is white. Okay, I don't mind being wrong. We enjoyed dinner together. Now I'm just opening up my new blanket. Um, I'm going to put it in the wash and then, oh, it comes with pillowcases. Hell yeah. So I'm going to put it in the wash, give it a little wash, and then put it in the dryer. Basically. Oh, there's another pillowcase. Can't say that I'm surprised because this was expensive, um, but it's... Pretty much exactly what I've been looking for. I think it's cute. And the fact that it's king size is a big win for me because my bed's a king, but I like to have a big blanket. All right, I'm gonna go put this in the wash. Okay, well, we're, we're done. Okay, <laughs> that was interesting. I mean, we went places, we did things, we ate food that looked halfway decent, though it looked a little bit dry, but you know what? Hey, I'm not complaining, but with that being said, <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.